Asava, this is Geo Blazable coming at you with another Destiny video. What is going on, guys? And today I want to talk to you about, about the new book called The Competitive Spirits. And the good news about this new book is that it's totally free, guys. No more having to pay $10 like we had last year. This book is going to be totally free for you guys to have. And all you're going to need to, need to do is just go to Amanda Holiday and pick it up. So at level number two, you, the book is going to allow you to get an emblem. At level number three, it's going to allow you to get SRL Champions Ornaments. These ornaments, you're going to be able to put it on your SRL gear. Yes, guys, the SRL gear will allow you to go ahead and place ornaments on, on them to make them look snappy and sassy. So do keep that in mind. And so once again, a re-rate, level number two, you get the emblem. Level number three, you will go ahead and get ornaments. At level number four, you get a Horde Frost, which is a armor shader, which has a silver and blue feel to it. Very interesting shader. Not my favorite, but I would have to say that out of all the record book, my favorite one would probably be the last one. That one looks really, really snappy. Next up, we have the Amanda Holiday tags, and these are tags that you're able to get for each individual kind of vendor within the tower. And each one does something, but we don't know. We've asked, I've asked everybody, and no one knows what these do. So I guess we're gonna have to wait till December the 13th to figure out what these actually do and what are they composed of and what exactly needs to be done to actually activate these or you know what 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 does it entail i don't know if it's going to be part of the quest line or part of strikes or part of srl but i'm assuming it has to do something with srl then we have another one which is called the good game this is an emote i'm gonna leave that one really a good emote but i want you guys to watch that one uh by yourselves and you know kind of enjoy that then we have one called surd tags as you saw we had the amanda tag and now we have the surd tag uh, which like i said we don't know what they do it just says those i serve want to have it so that's what we have. Next up at level number eight, once we hit level number eight, we will go ahead and unlock the EV31 Nightbird. This is a sparrow that you're able to obtain from the right off the book. So you can't get this any other way. You can only get this off the book. Very interesting sparrow. Nonetheless, it's, you know, it looks cool. It's like a flaming sparrow, very similar to the one we had, the blue one that we had for, oh, what was that event that we had that one for? I don't recall the event that was for, but we had one that was a trick sparrow, if you guys recall. Very similar to that one, just this is black and orange. And next up, we have the other one, which is at level number nine. We have the Saladin tags. And the Saladin tags, once again, we don't know what it is, but it says a treat for the young wolf. So I'm assuming it's going to coincide maybe with the sword and, you know, have that idea of how that works. So till you right now, we don't know what the tag events are. We've asked. I've tried to ask other people. They don't know what it is. So we're just going to have to roll with that. And last but not least, we have the shader that I was talking about, guys. This one looks very, very nice a shader. And that one you're going to be able to get at level number 10. And that shader will allow you to uh, look really, really snappy. Uh, really, really awesome shader. So, And at number 11, we got the Star of Dawn, which is an emblem you're able to obtain. Looks really, really cool and uh, nice looking. Will match your Sparrow amazing so if you guys haven't seen the other videos how to get the icebreaker all the new stuff that's coming with the you know new dlc or live event definitely go ahead and check that out the video make sure you follow the annotations at the end of the video and don't forget guys if you want to stay up to date to all things destiny make sure you keep it locked on this channel and i will catch you guys on the next video